Good morning, everyone. Hope you're having a good start to your Wednesday. Happy Hump Day. Uh, I've been thinking about a lot of things, but... Um, I was thinking last night, though, about people saying... that uh, they want you to get angry in order to change something that uh, that they change an injustice or change, get your get angry get a, they, 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 they say that with the intention of thinking okay well this will make people do things this will make people make changes and change things. But, um, I don't, I don't agree. I mean, it may make people get up and go out and protest and, 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 and march and it, it, it may do that. But, uh, I don't think using anger or hate is ever a good thing ever you can can you sometimes get a good result <coughs> <coughs> that's debatable uh, whether it's a good result or not entirely I mean you may get your goal accomplished but do you do any other damage on your way to getting your goal done um, I think you probably do I think anytime using negative things to accomplish a goal leaves other damages. Like I said, your goal may get accomplished, but uh, what, what, what other things have you caused and other pains have you caused by reaching your goal in that manner? It, uh, There are other ways to to accomplish the same thing. When you say, "Well, let's go out there and get everyone riled up," why uh, why riled up? Why not let's go out there and get everyone excited to make a change? Why not go out and and spread love and have the love? be the thing that rises up and and makes changes in the things which are I think and, and this is no offense to anybody that has used the 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 rile up method um, but I think that that's the lazy way of getting people organized on something because <laughs> all kinds of bad things can come out of that uh, you get people riled up uh, they don't make the best decisions on things that they're doing if they're angry and you say well aren't there things that make you angry yes but I'm working on um, switching that that up uh, when something makes me angry I, I stop and think about it and, 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 and switch it up get excited about love changing these things Get a crowd excited and, and, and about love and about changing things that are happening that are bad and switching them out to things that are loving. <laughs> it can be done the same way, really. I mean, I mean, and so you have to think about 
Think about that a little. Anyway, that's my thought for the day. <laughs> I'm not going to go on this too long. But, uh, um, yeah, it's just method. And, uh, and, and, and one can switch out for the other. And I say that if you use the love method of getting people excited about changing things for a more loving environment and loving things, get them worked up for that instead of angry and riled, uh, it, it, you'll get better results and you'll also improve many, many other things that are touched along the way by that love. <laughs> Something for you to think about. Anyway, and I know there's plenty of people that will argue it with me. And if you want to, we can argue it personally, but don't don't argue it on, on this post. Uh, I, I don't enjoy those kind of arguments where everyone's all mad and, and, and arguing with each other about what does better than what. Love is the number one thing, and, and there's no way of changing my view on that. Um, so uh, it is the most powerful thing. So anyway, keep, keep loving and keep spreading that love, and uh, I'll talk to you soon. Have a great day, everyone. Love you.